So now that we have got motivated, we are going to start with the process of uh, beautifying our garden. Now remember guys, we have been motivated, but we need dedication as well. It's not something that is going to happen with a snap of finger that you just snap your finger and you know everything is going to grow back and everything is going to look pristine and in beautiful condition. It requires a lot of dedication. That is the reason why this is going to take a very long process. I'm giving it another six to seven months for everything to start looking fresh like before. A lot of groundwork, uh, not like how we tend to see in videos wherein they just uh, you know slide through slides. In the first slide, it is everything is dead. And in the second slide, everything starts to grow. It's not that pretty simple. We have the motivation. We just need the dedication. We will fall in between. We will lack motivation in between. But what's important is that we keep going. Everything has to be started from scratch. Uh, every journey starts with one step. So we're going to go one step a day and see what are the new things that we can improve. What are the things we can do? So I want you guys to be a part of this journey and let's see what are the things we are going to do today. So day two, I'm just going to be cleaning all of the roots. I'm checking if there is anything available. If not, I'm just going to trash out all the soil and uh, I can reuse the soil for something else. Because a lot of those things are, you know, basically only soil. All of the things that are dead, I will be uh, repotting them. So you can see majority of the pots are empty and there's no point. I can probably use this soil and check for the roots as well. Like I'm checking for certain succulents that have roots over here like this. Like you can see this, the roots are still fresh. So I'm just going to keep them aside and I'm going to check. What is the best that I can do with the others? So today is going to be more of uh, checking and restocking stuff. Uh, a lot of things to take care. Uh, the colliest plants are all haywire because of lack of water. Uh, only this bunch looks a little bit better compared to the others. But I'm going to work towards it. I'm going to chop, chop most of these um, colliest plants and I'm going to replant them because they grow with stems. So. It's in a very terrible condition right now, but we are going to beautify this place. So I'm going to get rid of all of these, try and check what can be reused, what can be, but definitely I'm reusing all of the soil, but uh, most probably I'll clear out all the pots so that this can become a little bit more of a tidy place.